Alrighty, hello, Charles Crawford here, and in this video, I'm going to teach you how to install WordPress on your domain. So, I'm in GoDaddy right now, and as you can see, you basic you have to have a domain already purchased and hosting. So, um, let's go to hosting. It's multiple ways to get there, but yeah, and then launch. Then content content down to GoDaddy hosting connection. And then as you can see, there's WordPress here. And they also have Joomla and other systems. So click WordPress. Then install now. It's pretty simple. Then you just choose the domain name. I'm going to do it on this one. And then you have to create a password. Next. Um, I think I'm just going to keep it like this because I want it, I want this to be my, I want WordPress to be my, ho my home page, the index. So, okay. Well, I guess I should uh, pause it for now, but this is pretty straightforward. Okay, and after putting your password, um, then you should be good. So now you just have to wait for it to be fully installed and yeah, so you can go to My Applications just to check to make sure it went through. Okay, it's taking a while to load. Yeah, I'll pause it. Okay, so now you can see I have WordPress installed on a few other domain names, but you can see right here that uh, they got it on the domain name getmyownwebpage.com yeah so that was just a quick video so it's pretty simple um, yeah so now once it's installed all you have to do is go to your domain name dot com slash WP dash admin and then you'll be able to log in. So if I do it now it wouldn't work because it's not totally installed but it's your domain name slash WP dash admin and that's where you log in to go edit your website and change the theme and add content. So alrighty. Thank you for watching this video. Hope you enjoy. Thanks. Alrighty. Hello, Charles Crawford here. And in this video, I'm going to teach you how to install WordPress on your domain. So, I'm in GoDaddy right now. And as you can see, you, basic, you have to have a domain already purchased and hosting so um, let's go to hosting it's multiple ways to get there but yeah and then launch and 
then content content down to GoDaddy hosting connection. And then, as you can see, there's WordPress here. And they also have Joomla and other systems. So click WordPress. And then install now. It's pretty simple. And then you just choose the domain name. I'm going to do it on this one. then you have to create a password next um i think i'm just going to keep it like this because I want it I want this to be my I want WordPress to be my ho my home page the index so okay well I guess I should uh, pause it for now but this is pretty straightforward okay and after you put in your password um, then you should be good so now you just have to wait for it to be fully installed and yeah so you can go to my applications just to check to make sure it went through Okay, it's taking a while to load. Yeah, I'll pause it. Okay, so now you can see I have WordPress installed on a few other domain names, but you can see right here that uh, they got it on the domain name getmyownwebpage.com. Yeah, so that was just a uh, quick video so it's pretty simple um, yeah so now once it's installed all you have to do is go to your domain name dot com slash WP dash admin and then you'll be able to log in so if I do it now it wouldn't work because it's not totally installed but it's your domain name slash WP dash admin and that's where you log in to go edit your website and change the theme and add content so alrighty thank you for watching this video hope you enjoy thanks